Hi everyone, I'm here at Aspen Ice Arena, my home rink, and I got a great new video for you today. But first, I'd like to thank Sukyeon Cho for supporting my ice skating. And I'm back to drawing, so check out my artwork on my Etsy below. Today I will be showing you how to do the backward outside counter. Skate through the heel the entire time. Skate in through the heel, rise and turn on the heel, then exit skating through the heel. If you see any scratching, then you're riding the topics. If you see skidding, then the turn was forced. The turn comes from pressing into a solid entry edge, cross twisting, then rising and turning. Do the cross twist on the entry edge. As you rise and turn, drive through the shoulder of the skating foot. This will help keep you from unraveling on the exit edge. When doing back outside turns, check your tracings occasionally. Watch out for any changing, especially on the entry edge. A common mistake is to change the edge right before the turn and do a three turn instead. The turn has to go from a clean backward outside edge to a clean forward outside edge. Avoid pitching forward or sticking a hip out. Instead, remember to maintain your axis. There is a rhythm to each turn. When the entry is done correctly, the foot will want to turn. Catch the feeling of doing a turn correctly and try to replicate that feeling. Now I want to take a minute and talk about basic skating skills. Too often skaters skip working on the basics in favor of more interesting elements. Rushing ahead into difficult and more fun things, instead of developing solid basic skating skills, will only hurt one's progress in the long run. I haven't seen a good skater with bad basic skating skills. And what constitutes basic skating skills will change as you get better. For Ashley and me, various knee and ankle softness exercises, edges, crossovers, basic and difficult turns, as well as Choctaws and Twizzles, are all part of our basic skating skills to-do list, because they are the building blocks of our programs. So know what your basic skating skills to-do list is, and work on said skills on a daily basis. Because if the foundation is shaky, everything will be shaky.